That's right, everyone. We're about to play Nancy Drew, the Silent Spy. This is number 29 in the series. I'm just like all of you. I've been looking forward to playing this ever since the teaser that we saw in Ghost of Thornton Hall. Now, ever since that game, I went on and recorded, oh, half a dozen or so Nancy Drew games. So, if you want to check out more of the older Nancy Drew games, just look down in the video description. You'll find playlists for some of the other ones that I have recorded. But enough of that. Let's get into this. We need to find out... What what happened with Kate and why we're in Scotland and let's go let's hit new game alright so standard difficulty level choice here uh, I've been playing all of my Nancy Drew games on master alright so we're at our standard Nancy Drew desk uh, oh what's this Cathedral Confidential Nancy Drew our agency has been monitoring your progress for some time now and we are quite impressed with your accomplishments I'll get to the point. Certain events have forced our organization to reopen a case that has gone unsolved for the last eight years. Hmm. That's about as long as Kate's been missing, right? Right. Although impressive, your fieldwork experience is only part of the reason we're requesting your help. Simply put, Miss Drew, we're asking for your help, not only because of what you can do, but because of who you are. Eight years ago, Kate Drew died in a single automobile crash in the outskirts of Glasgow. This official version of your mother's death is, as you may have suspected, not the entire truth. Dun dun dun! Her death was not an accident. We have strong evidence that Kate was killed by the very group she was investigating. We need your help. We've included a plane ticket and have a room ready for your, you at Glaucus Lodge. You will be briefed upon arrival. There is no time to spare. The future of Glasgow may rest in your hands. All right, cool. Ooh. Mom? Mom. Mom. Oh, wow. Ooh, look at this fiery unicorn. Oh, it's, it's a memory. A childhood memory, wow. Mom played the piano, okay. Mom, get the phone, hurry up. Drew Residence, Kate speaking. You know this line isn't secure. Moira, stop. I'll call you. Hi, Mom. Oh, you can't see I'm up here watching you. Oh, Mom's got the same hair color as me. It's a redhead. Is that the last time I saw mom? I think so. Alright, cool. Uh, did we get that? Okay, we saw that already. Oh. Wyvern Gate? This is where mom was in the picture. Okay, now what? Hey, my suitcase! I'm on it. That guy's a thief! I really, really thought I was going to get that guy. Sorry. <sighs> Thanks for trying. I'm Alec. Nancy. That's a nice offer, but why would you want to do that? It doesn't look like you work here. I'm in the business of finding people who don't want to be found. Well, I won't turn down help. So you're a private eye? I'm more of a skip tracer. When someone goes off the grid, I get a call and track them down. They skip. I trace. I had some very important things that belonged to my mom in that suitcase. I really need them back. Go check into your hotel. I will find your suitcase. Oh, what a gentleman Alec is. All right, so we are uh, are in room number seven two seven. It's locked. But I do have my hotel key. Let's go inside. Oh, telephone. Nancy, glad you made it. I'm your cathedral contact, Ewan. There's a case file in your room. Read it, memorize it. That's your playbook. It'll keep you alive. I've got a bit of housekeeping to do. Get settled. I'll call you when I'm ready. 
You in. All right. The Scottish accent totally reminds me of my father, who was born in Glasgow. All right. So we get some pretty flowers that are pretty. Whoa. We have a beautiful view of outside. What else is in the room here? Uh, let's see, go this way. That's just the flowers. Can't really see much over there. Oh. What do we have here? Hmm. A charger of some hmm. sort. Telephone we can't use. Ooh, what's in the closet? Aha! Wall safe. Wait. Most secure password ever? One, two, three, four, five. Oh well. We tried. My hacking days are over. Uh, what do we have over here? Ooh, we got money. We got paid. 21 monies. Top secret? Eyes only? Okay. Oh, we have two pages, so this is going to be a good read for us. Ms. Drew, I must welcome you to Scotland with very unfortunate news. You have been led here under false pretenses. You were not here as a guest of Cathedral. You were not asked here to investigate the death of your mother by MI5. You have been lied to. Kate Drew, your mother was a Cathedral operative eight years ago. A small cell associated with a terrorist organization known as Revenant attempted to attack Glasgow. Kate was instrumental in stopping the attack, now known as the Colony Operation. We believe the organization your mother took offline has returned to full strength and is now planning to mount the attack once more. We believe you have been brought here by Revenant for reasons we do not yet fully understand. If this is overwhelming, do not worry. We will give you access to information as needed. We are in the process of briefing your contact on the situation. He will bring you in soon. Your first priority is to locate and make contact with a local reporter named... Okay, so I'm going to struggle with this name here. Mora? Is that Mora? She was considered a person of interest in the first attempted attack on Scotland, but was never directly connected. She has since refused to cooperate with this organization. We will be keeping a close watch on you at all times, but this does not mean that you will be protected. Please note the difference. Wow, that's harsh. Move forward cautious, cautiously and trust no one. Anyone who approaches you should be considered a suspect. Attached, you will find a basic brief to get you somewhat caught up on what you need to know. Okay, right, page two. Cathedral, an organization dedicated to the safety of Glasgow and surrounding areas. This organization acts as an intelligence outpost and reports to MI5. It is equivalent to what would be a local branch of the FBI in the United States. Colony Operation, the attempted non-lethal biological attack on Glasgow that was thwarted by Cathedral operatives eight years ago. The party responsible for that attack was never confirmed though it is believed Revenant was involved. Current intelligence points to the signs that the operation may be restarting. Colony Formula The colony attack required a very specific and difficult to produce biological element. It is believed, but not verified, that Kate Drew found a way to destroy all records of the formula and placed the individual responsible for creating it into hiding. Revenant Very little is known about this group. Revenant is believed to be behind a number of terrorist events around the globe over the course of the last few decades. Paradoxically, this same group has been linked to as many counter-terrorism, counter-terrorist activities during the same period. The aim of this organization is not yet known. I'm going to say its aim is profit. All right, so cool. We have uh, been fully briefed with our case file. So, let's see much else to do here. Uh, I guess we can go out here. Oh, hello. The American girl. Do I know you? You do now. I'm Bridget. I'll be outside. There's something very important I need to tell you. Okay, Bridget. 
Ah, 728. So what do we have here? Oh, that's back to my room there. No, 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 I don't want to be here. Turn around, turn around. Back outside. Is this where I want to be? Huh. Oh, what's this hand mean? Whoa, what's this? It's a foam charm. Okay, so I forgot to mention that. I do have the uh, special edition from Her Interactive, so I have my lovely foam charms. I'll be collecting them. And the mini games that I don't typically play them. Oh, Renograms. Oh my god. Run far away from those. <laughs> those are so tough. Oh, what's up here? Sparkles. Ooh, got paid. Alright, so let's go this way then. I guess I should uh, keep an eye for shiny things. Yay! Anything else shiny? I don't know. Okay, well this is going to take forever if I take my sweet time here. Go to the elevator. All aboard. Hmm. Go to the ground level. No. Hmm. Okay, so let's go over here. It Let's might see. be good to read up on the attack. Nice little newspaper. Ah, uh, I see Bridget's over there. Oh, Robbie Burns. Now I want to have some haggis for some reason. Uh, trash can. Okay. What's over here? Help wanted. Oh, this is adorable. Look at all this good stuff. Ooh, tablet. That reminds me of my aunt. She's also from Scotland and she makes this stuff yeah. all the time. It's basically sugar squares. <laughs> Very sweet. Very sugary. Ah, uh, what do we oh, help? Hello. You want to make some money? Then make some cookies. The cookie order shows up down there. Make it exactly as shown if you want to get paid. The I'm more cookies you make, the wealthier you get. Totally going to make cookies. Oh, look at that. It's a gummy bear. Like Ryan's gummy bears. So make ourselves a cookie. Gummy bear. White, it looks like. And blue. Serve it. This would be so embarrassed by me right now. Why? What was wrong with that one? That was perfect. This one's gonna be a heart-shaped one. All right. Yeah. I mean, let's get paid. Nancy's here on business, but you know, she has to do odd jobs. At least she gets paid to do this one. All right. How many more are we gonna make? I don't know. We gotta make a little bit of money, a little bit of coin. Make a round one. I wanna make a star one, so. Alright, so what's here? Green looks like next. You know what? I can handle not being good at this. Really? Really? I thought I was great at this. Do I just have to be fast? Is that the idea? I think so. Oh wow, okay, so I'm totally sucking this one up. Uh, let's see, this is tricky. Um, yeah, totally screw this one up. Okay, I might have to give up on this one. <laughs> this one's hard. Uh... Serve it. Need to work on my cookie spotting skills. That one was terrible. Okay, this is a hard one. This will be the last cookie that we make for a little while. I mean, it's a pretty good way to make some some cheddar. Not bad. If yeah, I say so, so we got myself? fifty. All right, so that's enough cookie making. We'll be back for that. Let's talk you to had Bridget. something important to tell me? Just that I love Americans. Some people say you're ignorant, entitled slobs, but not me. I don't know if that was important. Of course it is! You've got the best cities, the best bands, Hollywood! Your star may be fading, but you're still the cool kids at the global lunch table. Teach me your ways! 
I'm sorry, but I'm sort of in the middle of something pretty important. I'm a little overbooked. You say that now, but I can tell we're going to be friends. Or enemies. Either way, get used to this face right here. Okay, could you... Can tell you tell Scotland? me a little bit about Scotland? Just a bit, then. Well, it's old, it's cold, and I like it all the same. I got a book about it. I could get it for you. It's only up in my room. Okay, well, I guess that's the end of our conversation with Bridget. Well, I feel a little lonely. Let's call up our... Oh, I'll call up her dad. Carson, daddy. You've reached the personal line of Carson Drew. Please direct all business matters to the firm switchboard. Dad, you're not available? Okay, what about my BFF? My boyfriend forever. Come on, Ned. Answer. Hi, it's Ned. I can't talk right now. Leave a message. Oh, so sad. Alright, well, let's uh, make one more cookie. Because can. Oh, no, this is a tricky one. Or is it? Good grief. This is... Uh... So I think I have to put... I'm not sure I understand how this works. Yeah, see? Bess would be so embarrassed by me right now. <laughs> there you go. Bess would be embarrassed by me. I wanted to make a star one there, and I've made one. Bess would be so embarrassed by me right what? now. How is that wrong? Oh my goodness, look at this one. Okay, let me get out of here. This is way too hard. <laughs> uh, did she go back in here? I have no idea what floor I'm on. I guess I only have access to my floor and the main floor. Seven. Oh, actually, we don't have a clue where she went. Uh, Bridget, I'm talking about. No, we don't. Okay, let's go downstairs. And to the train station. Oh, wait, she's there. Hang on. Take me back. How do I... Uh. <laughs> I'm completely lost now. How is this not the... Exit to the hotel. There we go. Hello, Bridget. I got that book you wanted. Here you go. Thank you. I like books on Scotland. Thanks. Uh, let's find out if you do want you things better. Do you work or go to school or what do you do? You think I'm from Glasgow? Is that okay? No! It's glorious! I'm actually from Witten. It's always been a dream of mine to live in the city. And I'm sort of checking it out to see if it's for me. Fair enough. How long are you going to be in Glasgow? Not long. You? I have no idea. How could you tell I'm an American? I've got a sixth sense about these things. I saw a guy on the train. I just walked up to him and said, You're from Belgium, aren't you? He wasn't, but he should have been. He just had that look. Can I follow you around for a whole lot? Uh, you seem really nice. Yeah. The nicest? Ask me, Gran. But I can't really have anyone following me. Please, don't take it personally. No, I, I understand. Bye, Bridget. See you around. Goodbye. And that'll be a good place for us to take a break, and we'll see you in the next episode of Silence Bye. Let me know what you think about the game so far. Put your comments down below. Again, if you want to watch any of my other previous Nancy Drew series, there'll be links in the video description. So I'll talk to you very soon. Bye-bye.